All right, what's up guys? This is Thomas at Hoover Automotive. Uh, gonna give this YouTube thing a shot. So I made a video about two years ago saying I was gonna start YouTube and never did. Uh, this is partly why. So that's my shop right there. And uh, it's been um, a work in progress for a while now. I've been working 90 hour weeks trying to get this thing up and going. And uh, it's about time I try and show you guys around. First, this is the kind of stuff we like to work on. Overlanding, off-road, camping, Tundras, Tacomas, 4Runners, FJs. I'm a Toyota specialist. I'm a Nissan specialist, a Nissan dealer tech for 11 years. As you can see, those are the things we like to work on. Here, this is my personal 98 SC300. Back there, you've got a 91 right-hand drive, 1JZ, 5-speed MK3. You got a uh, Infiniti Q60 full bolt-on, actually is here for an engine, but that thing's making about 550 horsepower at the wheel. We got this, this is my other baby. This is a uh, 85 Toyota Celica Supra. So if you guys watch this channel, you will see this get a T56 swap. Uh, it will be 2J swapped. Um, I'm working on a 300ZX right now for a parasitic draw. Crappy old Ford truck needs some work. We got a convertible Solera, needs about six grand worth of work. And then we got over here a rust bucket of a LX470. But as you guys will see if you watch this channel at all, um, every day I get a new car. Something cool, something old, uh, usually Asian. I have Subarus, Infinities, Nissans, Hondas, Acuras, Lexuses, Toyotas. I've got a bunch of stuff back here. So that's a G37, got a Chrysler. Normally there's more cars than this, but I've been uh, catching up for two days on getting everything out the door. I was a little overwhelmed. Car 300ZX in the corner. There's my crappy boat over there that's for sale. And if you look way in the back, there's a, uh, a shell of another LX470 that customer uh, brought to me. Uh, he actually talked about doing a frame swap, and uh, the first one over here on the lift is just too rusty for that. But uh, here, let me go ahead and give you guys a little quick tour. So I'm gonna turn the camera back around again. So we got junk over here. This is the storage pile. Wheels and tires for customers of mine. These are a lot of the cars I work on. That's supposed to say First Coast Toyotas, but the wind blows that, fan, that, uh, that flag up all the time. But five bay shop, it's just me. As of right now, been here about seven months. Redid the whole place when we moved in. Tools galore, equipment galore, stuff, junk everywhere. That's the customer shelf for all their parts. We got a, a 1UZ over here that's going to be put into a uh, 92 or 93 Toyota Tacoma two-wheel drive. This is the adapter kit to convert that to the W55 that's in the truck. Uh, we got parts from Z1 for the Q60, doing an aluminum drive shaft. I mean... I like a little bit of everything. I like the Asian stuff specifically. Um, that's my passion. Um, if any of you look at the other videos, you'll see the Mark IV that I used to have that uh, I ended up actually having to sell it because of the business. Uh, well, not have to. Um, the business was open. I was going for about four months and uh, I just kind of looked around at the market and realized, you know, having a, a Mark IV is great, but having, you know, six figures from the car would be a little bit better. So uh, I did sell the car. Not quite six figures, but pretty close. Um, paid off all the business debts, got everything squared away, personal debts squared away. So, uh, yeah, guys, if you're in the Jacksonville, Florida area at all, um, we're in Orange Park, you know, southwest side of, of Jacksonville. Um, this is the stuff we specialize in. I want to bring you all along for the ride with all the, the builds from my friends, my buddies, uh, the First Coast Toyotas group. There's a lot of fantastic builds in there. Um, my truck, I'll show you some modifications I'm gonna do on it here shortly. Uh, the Lexus is gonna be, this is gonna be, uh, sorry, I probably shouldn't do that. Um, it's gonna be a 1UZ swap turbo with a built auto. This is gonna be my drag car for the shop. So you're gonna follow along with that. The Celica Supra is gonna be just a, a badass street car. Just something I can have fun with on the weekends, go to cars and coffee and uh, there you go. Hopefully you guys will want to stick around and watch a little bit more. 
Um, feel free, like, subscribe, comment, give me some, some ideas of what you want me to work on. Uh, comment on what I am working on. Comment on the videos. Let me know how I'm doing. Uh, this is new to me. It's definitely weird uh, talking to a camera by myself. But uh, hopefully I can contribute back to the automotive community. Uh, help out some of you guys looking to, to do some modifications yourself. Um, show you some of the issues as a tech that we run into all the time. You know, dealerships, same thing. You know, I can show you some diagnostic procedure, some of the tools we use, uh, what goes into repairing vehicles, uh, and why sometimes it is so expensive. But uh, yeah, a little bit of everything coming your way. Feel free to like and subscribe and uh, let me know how I'm doing. Thanks, guys.